Good morning and welcome back to the Sullivan family. It's day seven, it's Monday, it's week two of lockdown. Um, yeah, so we managed to do quite a few videos last week, which we're really pleased about. It's quite nice for me being off work and managing to do these videos. Um, you know, I, I love, love, love making these videos. So trying to keep the content there, trying to keep the videos flowing. So today I'm going to just take you around the house. It is just gone 10 o'clock in the morning. I've shaved my head, thank God for that, because it was starting to look a bit weird. I'm just going to walk around the house a minute, because I know the kiddies are now doing their um, schoolwork time in the morning. Hang on a sec, I'm just going to flick you around. Where's Joseph? We've got to be quiet. Joseph is in there somewhere. Joseph is sleeping, having his little morning nap. Here we go. How's everybody getting on? Yes, I'm playing my unicorns. I'm playing You're playing unicorns? Let's have a look then. I'm chewing on the floor. All right. Are you doing jigsaw with them, Olivia? Yeah, but they left. Oh, they left. Oh, Olivia, you're so helpful. Hi, Mommy. I know they take a lot of patience, don't they, bless them. So what's everybody doing then? Are you Have you started your projects? I love you, my dog. You're not doing your project. What are you doing? What's next? Science. Science homework? Yes. Hello. Have you guys started your project? I have already Oh, well, that's really good. Let's have a look. So, what we've done, or what Zoe's idea was, was to buy a jotter for the kiddies and let them do a project of their choice. Being that it is now. Easter holidays, we're kind of easing up on the schedule for a couple of weeks till we get back on to the proper school routine, aren't we? Hey, eh? so, so you're just doing your project. So what are you doing, Eva? Foxes. How did I guess? <laughs> Eva's favourite subject of all time: foxes. How much? How much do you love foxes? Eva, this isn't the time to go mute. Sorry. How much do you like foxes? 100%. More than 100%. 1000%. More than 1 million. A billion percent. And what are you doing? Space. That's probably my most favourite favorite subject. So we'll be helping you. Have you got my space book, have you? Mm -hmm. Good. No, we're basically all doing a different subject every week. A different subject every week. So Eva's doing. Oh, I see what you mean. Okay, that's a good idea. Toby's doing plane, and I'm doing space. Toby, I'm going to give you a hand with your plane one in a minute. Being that I'm in the uh, in the aviation yeah, industry. Yeah. Um, how come, right? The only book we haven't got in the house is a book on planes. <laughs> I don't know. What's that? I've got a lot of manuals. I don't want to get I've got manuals on helicopters. No. If that helps. He's eight, seven. Do you? Yeah, I've got manuals on fixing uh, helicopters and no engines and gas turbines and stuff like that. I'll show him some of my stuff I made. Okay, go on then. I'll show Toby some. You've already got toys out, yeah? You've got toys out. All right, what are you doing? He's writing down different types of planes, aren't you, Toby? So, le, 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 so le. Wait, uh, keep playing your unicorns for now. Uh, so. Good girl. So you've got well different Amen. types of planes, passenger aeroplanes, helicopters, jets and fighter planes. So what about cargo planes? Oh, there you go, Daddy can help you that. Know? Cargo naughty. planes? C A R. Write it down. And then we'll get pictures oh, up to it. Picture of his plane, though, like. I know it's a brilliant picture. I'll I'll, sh I'll show everybody at home. Um, I've found this. C A airplanes, but it's not all that. C A. C A. C A. Cut A. Cut A. R. G. Last joke G. R. G. Oh, cargo planes. Yeah. So with your plane. Oh, it's a really good plane, Toby. It's really good. So what are we going to do next then? Should we think of some more aeroplanes? Yeah? Jumbo jets. What about propeller planes and jet planes? Like a Spitfire. Yeah. Like a Spitfire or um, 
What else have we got? We've got grubs. Yeah. In the air force. Yeah. Um, what else have we got? Hurricane. Wow. Lancaster. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all those kinds of planes. So how does a wing work then, yeah? How does a wing work? So you've got the wing shape. It looks a little bit like... A triangle. Not a triangle. It looks... A, if you look at the side of a wing, it looks a little bit like that, right? So you've got the front of the wing where the air hits it. Right, and that's the back of the wing where the air goes that way, goes off it. And sometimes you have like a little aileron in the back to help it go up and down, right? So the air goes over the top of the wing, right? Like that. And then out the back. And it also goes under the wing, like that, mm -hmm. yeah? Mm -hmm. But what happens is that the air that goes over the top of the wing goes faster than the bottom of the wing, yeah? So this air that goes over the top goes faster than the air that goes under the bottom. And what happens is it creates uh, a push, the air pushes on the bottom of the wing. So it creates lift. So it creates what we call lift. Yeah? So that's how a wing works. Did you get that? So is that a good bit to add to your project? Mm -hmm. So the air goes over the top of the wing faster than the bottom of the wing. So I'm now going to demonstrate how a wing works using this piece of paper. Yeah? This piece of paper. You ready? So if I if the if I make the air go faster over the top than the bottom, what do you think is gonna happen? What happened? It lifts, it lifts up. You see? Just like so that. that's exactly how a wing works, apart from it's a different shape than a piece of paper. But it will essentially lift up. You see what I mean? Give it a go then. No, 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 no. Rest it down like that. Rest it down like that. Now blow over the top. Blow over the top of it. Faster, faster, there you go, it's going, there you go, it's moving, let me have one more shot, give it a go then, no, blow over the top, don't spit all over it, now the airplane's going to crash, because the wings are wet. <laughs> Where's my airplane gone? So there you go. All right, Toby, go on then. Show us what you've done on this page then. So are you going to talk about your airplane? Yes. And we've labelled everything now, haven't we? I don't know, I've got to colour that thing in. That's okay. Yeah. Do I, I'm going to do it. So what's the yellow bit called? Fuselage. Yeah. And what about the purple? It's the cockpit. Yep. The wings are green. The wraps are brown. The ailerons, ailerons are red. The tail is blue. The tail are grey. The engines are pink. And it's yellow. It's really good. Really good. Go on then, Noah. How have you gone with your space project? What are you talking about at the moment? What is the universe? Wow. I don't know. Oh, wow, that's really good. 
You're doing one of my favourite subjects, by the way. This is your bit. I oh, know it's my bit. How's the foxes going? On my second page. Oh, wow. And what about you, Charlotte? What are you up to? Singing. What are you up to, Charlotte? Singing. <coughs> Music. I don't know. I don't know. Music. Music. Agnes May. What's that green again? Where's that green? Oh, no, Agnes, what's this one? Tomato! Tomato? What is it? Tomato! It's actually tomato! You're going to pop it in? Put it in there? Alright, so uh, creative time today is nails! Are you getting. You <laughs> Yeah. So he's doing every mummy's doing everyone now everyone's nails, is she? Let's have a look now. Just put them back in for a minute, alright? Beautiful boy. Shall I get my nails done? For work. Yeah? What do you think my boss will say to that? You get your toenails done. Say hello, Joseph. Hello. Say hello. What do you want? Oh dearie me. Okay, so um, Creative Tom's Day Monday is a bit of nail polishing. A bit of nail polishing. I think Zoe's, Zoe's been. Uh, the, I think the girls have been nagging Zoe for ages to do a bit of nail polishing. So um, that's what we're doing today. But essentially, we've come up with an idea for the rest of the week. It's um, something that again we spotted on Facebook. We do come up with our own ideas, but we really like those, these ideas. Then you can put Who's that? <laughs> oh my God, random. So um, we've spotted this. Uh, we've spotted this idea on um, on Facebook, and it's making elephants out of old milk bottles, plastic milk bottles, or milk cartons, whatever you want to call them, and they're really good. Um, ow. So uh, that's what we're going to be doing this week. Obviously, we'll be following what we're doing all week uh, with a daily vloggy video. A daily vloggy YouTube video. Won't we? Oh, look, you can tell I've had my hair cut. The kids love it. Are you stroking my head because I've had my hair cut? Yeah. Do you like it? <laughs> Very nice. Do I look like Gru? Yeah, do, I, do I look like Gru of yeah. Despicable Me? Light bulb! <laughs> so, stay tuned to our channel. Please subscribe to our channel. Please drop us a like. Please comment. We really appreciate any interaction with our channel. And um, we'll see you in the next video tomorrow. Definitely. Say bye then. Bye. Bye. Say bye, Joseph. Yeah, baby. <laughs>